Hey, what's happening guys? Today we are at Trader Joe's. We're gonna be talking about the best low carb keto snacks and snack ideas that you'll find here at Trader Joe's and that you can buy right now in 2021. Now that said, there's actually a ton of keto snacks here at Trader Joe's for really any occasion, for when you're on the go, for when you're traveling, you're at work, you're at school, or even if you're just at home and you wanna throw a few things together to make yourself a quick, easy, low carb keto snack, They've got it here at Trader Joe's. So let's just jump right into the good stuff because we have a lot to get to. Talk about some of these Trader Joe's keto snacks. So the first thing I've got for you guys are the Keto Fudge Bites by Do Good Snacks. These are $4.99 per bag at Trader Joe's. You get seven Fudge Bites in a bag and each Fudge Bite has just two net carbs. So if you find yourself on the go or traveling or just craving something sweet and chocolatey and you love fudge, give these a look the next time you're at Trader Joe's. We're tasting one of these. So this is what a fudge bite looks like. Kind of has like a protein bar feel to it. Just like a third of the size of a protein bar. Mm. So these look kind of like a protein bar, taste kind of like a protein bar, probably a little bit better tasting than most protein bars that I've had actually. Lots of good chocolate flavor here. Uh, there's even pieces of chocolate inside and of course i love the fact that they're individually wrapped so you're getting some portion control built in to your snacking i like the messiest eater i've got chocolate all over my car next up we have the trader giotto's oven baked cheese bites these are definitely one of the most well-known and popular keto snacks that you can find at trader joe's and for good reason you can do a ton of stuff with these but i think the best thing you could do with these is to actually pair them with some of the keto friendly dips that Trader Joe's sells. And if you're wondering what dips I'm talking about, just stick around because we're gonna get to them. But just know if you pair these with the dips here at Trader Joe's, it is like a whole different level of deliciousness. Now, as far as the carb count goes on these, just one carb per package. And as far as the price, it is $2.69 per package as well. Next up, we've got the crispy, crunchy broccoli florets that you'll find at Trader Joe's. You'll find these in the chip aisle of the store. This bag is $2.99, and the entire bag of broccoli florets has just two net carbs. So if you're trying to put a little crunchiness in your keto snack life, give these a look the next time you're there. Also in the chip aisle, you'll find these wasabi-flavored roasted seaweed snack packs at Trader Joe's. And if I'm being totally honest, these are really not one of my favorite snacks to get at Trader Joe's, but a lot of people in the keto community love snacking on roasted seaweed. It has zero net carbs, so I get the allure of snacking on it. I just, I'm not a fan of the taste and texture of roasted seaweed, so it's just, it's not for me. But maybe it's for you, and if it is, Trader Joe's has some good prices on these seaweed snack packs. They're just a dollar here. So in the salad section of Trader Joe's, you'll find these jicama wraps, and these are definitely one of the most popular keto-friendly things you can buy at Trader Joe's. A lot of people love these. Of course, they're not a snack in their own right, but they are a great thing to make snacks with, specifically mini tacos. A lot of people love making mini tacos with these, and for good reason, they make fantastic taco shells, and the carb count on them is crazy. Every two jicama wraps only has one net carb. Now, if you're wondering how much these cost, a 12 pack of these at Trader Joe's will run you $4.49. So right by the jicama wraps, you'll find these Trader Joe's cauliflower thins. And these are definitely one of the most popular things that anybody following the keto diet is buying at Trader Joe's. And I get it, they're not a snack in their own right, but they're used to make snacks. You make a ton of snacks out of these, specifically mini pizzas and mini keto sandwiches. And the best part about these is definitely the carb count. Every two thins has just one net carb. So you can do a ton of snacking for not a lot of carb eating, and you know I'm a fan of that. Anyway, as far as the price goes on these, Trader Joe's is selling this four pack of thins for $3.99. So one thing Trader Joe's is known for is their dips, and they have a ton of low-carb, keto-friendly dip options in the store. I'm not gonna go over every option that you can find there that's keto-friendly, but I will go over some of my favorites with you guys. And I know these aren't necessarily snacks by themselves, but they can be part of snacking, and they can make snacking more delicious. So with that said, each one of these dips has less than two grams of carbs and costs less 
than $4. First up, we've got the Olive Tapenade with Kalamata and Chakadiki Olives. Next, we've got the Avocado Tatsiki Dip. The pub cheese here at Trader Joe's is so good. It's a combination of blue cheese and cheddar cheese, and you can spread it on pretty much anything. The Roma Seco Dip is absolutely to die for. It's roasted red peppers, tomatoes, and crushed almonds. Mm. It is so tasty. I'm absolutely obsessed with this stuff, the Trader Joe's Italian Bomba Hot Pepper Sauce. I love adding the stuff to my keto-friendly sandwiches. Just makes everything a bit spicier and a bit tastier. And then finally, we've got the Chunky Artichoke and Jalapeno Dip. And actually, I love dipping my two-minute keto crackers in this stuff. It is the perfect combination. You get the crunch from the crackers, the spiciness of the jalapeno, the chunkiness from the artichoke. It is a match made in heaven. And if you haven't checked that two-minute keto cracker recipe out, I'll leave a link to it in the video description below. So if you pick up any of these dips, you can give that cracker recipe a try. Now, like I said, these are just some of my favorite low carb keto dips that Trader Joe's sells. They have a ton more. And if I forgot one, if you've got a favorite that I missed here, let me know what it is in the comments below because I'm always up for trying more of these dips. So another great on the go keto snack idea or travel keto snack idea that you'll find at Trader Joe's are the Chomps beef sticks. A lot of the beef jerky at Trader Joe's is really high in sugar, so I don't recommend getting any of the beef jerky packets. But if you can find these Chomps beef sticks, they have zero carbs, they have zero sugar, they are very, very keto friendly. Also, they're just $1.69 per stick. So if you're looking for the best beef jerky-ish option they can buy at Trader Joe's, this is the option you want to go with. Next up, we've got the Just a Handful of Olives Olive Snack Packs from Trader Joe's. These are less than a gram of carbs per package, so they're basically a zero-carb keto snack idea. They make a fantastic keto snack if you're traveling because you don't have to refrigerate them. They're so small, you can bring them with you pretty much anywhere. Also, if you're at school and you want to put a few of these in your book bag just to have on hand for when you're feeling kind of hungry, you need something to hold you over to your next meal, I think these could be a really useful thing to have for that. They're also less than a dollar per package, so they're super reasonable for something so convenient. Definitely give these a look the next time you're there. So if you're looking for a ready to eat keto snack option at Trader Joe's, they have these cage-free cooked and peeled hard-boiled eggs in the egg section of the store. You get six hard-boiled eggs per bag, and the bag costs $2.69. So if you love snacking on deli meat like I love snacking on deli meat, I highly recommend checking out the organic hickory smoked turkey breast at Trader Joe's. There's only three ingredients in here, turkey, water, and salt. That is it. No sugar, no dextrose, no carbs in this deli meat. So it's really one of the highest quality deli meats you can buy. As far as the price goes on it, it is $4.99 for this six ounce package. Trader Joe's obviously has a ton of fantastic low carb keto cheese options, but one of my favorites and one I highly recommend checking out and one I think is great for snacking is the Spanish tapas style cheese platter. You get Iberico, you get Cabra Alvino, and you get Manchego cheese in here, all very, very delicious cheeses. As far as the price goes, it's $4.69 for this five and a half ounce package and every serving of this cheese has just one gram carbs. So in the baking section, you'll find these organic unsweetened coconut chips. And these are another great sweet keto snack idea. A lot of people mistakenly think that coconut chips are high in carbs because most of the time they're sweetened with sugar. But if you find the unsweetened ones like they sell at Trader Joe's, they actually only have two net carbs per serving. And the price here at Trader Joe's on these coconut chips is pretty fantastic as well. This eight ounce bag is just a dollar. 99. So Trader Joe's actually has a huge assorted nut section in the store and you'll find a ton of really, really great nuts in there. One of my favorite to snack on are the Guara almonds. These are a lot like a Marcona almond. They're seasoned with extra virgin olive oil and sea salt. They're very delicious, very fancy fancy. So what I like to do with these is actually add them to like a keto friendly charcuterie board. If we're going to have some people over and entertain, these are really nice to kind of have out and be a part of that board. Now, as far as how much these cost, this is a seven ounce bag of guar almonds and it costs $4.99 at Trader Joe's. So like I said, Trader Joe's has a huge nut selection, but just an example of the great prices at Trader Joe's. Well, I picked up this one pound bag of hazelnuts because I plan on making some keto Nutella as a recipe for the channel really soon. And I paid $6.99 for this one pound bag. Usually hazelnuts are like twice that price. So if you really are looking for the best price on nuts, I highly recommend 
checking out Trader Joe's. So right next to the olives, you'll find these cornichone pickles. And if you've seen any of my other snack hauls, you know I love snacking on pickles. They are one of my favorite keto snacks. These cornichones, they actually make a fantastic addition to a keto charcuterie board because they're so small, they fit on pretty much any board. And let's be honest, who doesn't like snacking on some mini pickles? These are sure to be a hit if you add them to your board. Now, with that said, my favorite part of these is that they are a zero net carb keto snack idea. And as far as the price goes, Trader Joe's is selling these for $2.69. In the cured meat section, you'll find this Trader Joe's cured prosciutto. And this is definitely one of the highest quality cured meats you can buy pretty much anywhere, actually. The ingredients in here, it's just ham and salt. So there's no sugar, no anything extra added to this stuff. And of course, that means that the stuff also has zero grams of carbs. So there's a lot to love about this. If you love snacking on cured meats, I highly recommend picking some of this up. As far as the price goes, Trader Joe's is charging $3.99 for this four ounce package of prosciutto. The marinated and grilled artichoke hearts at Trader Joe's are another keto snack that I like to keep around my house. I just like to snack on these out of the jar. I also like to add them to salads. They make every salad taste better. Every serving of them has just two net carbs, and the price that Trader Joe's is charging on these is $2.99. In the prepared meat section, you'll find this package of roasted and sliced chicken with rib meat. And of course, this could be more than a snack. It could be a meal, but I really, really like this stuff. I think it's so great to have something so convenient and there's no garbage added to this chicken. It's just chicken, extra virgin olive oil, black pepper, sea salt, that is it, that's all that's in here. So this stuff is a great option to keep around the house. If you want something quick and easy, you don't feel like cooking anything, or maybe you're at work and you forgot your lunch, and you know you could just run to Trader Joe's now and grab yourself a package of this pre-cooked chicken. That said, as far as the price goes on this package of chicken, it is $6.99 at Trader Joe's. Also in the prepared meat section, you'll find this seasoned roast beef, and this stuff just makes a fantastic snack on its own, but I think if you pair it with those cauliflower thins that we talked about earlier in the video, you have yourself a really delicious low-carb keto-friendly roast beef sandwich, or a makeshift one anyways. Now, what I love about this stuff is that there's no sugar or anything added to this, even though it's a deli meat here at Trader Joe's, and that means that there's basically no carbs. I mean, there's less than a carb Per serving here and that's just because there's some spices added to the roast beef now with all that said the price on this eight ounce package of roast beef is five dollars and 49 cents here at trader joe's in the cheese section you'll find these satero salami sticks i really like these as keto snacks for work or for school because they fit so great in a lunchbox this is a two pack of salami sticks by the way each pack just has one carb and there's eight salami sticks Per pack. And as far as the price goes on these, Trader Joe's is selling the two pack for $1.79. In the veggie section of Trader Joe's, you're gonna find one of my favorite vegetables to snack on, and that is mini zucchinis. If you've never snacked on a mini zucchini before, you are missing out and you need to start snacking on them because they are one of the best keto-friendly vegetables you can eat. Every 100 grams of zucchini has just over two and a half grams of net carbs, which makes it one of the lowest carb vegetables that there is. And these mini zucchinis, they just make it so easy to snack on them. They're great for like dipping into pretty much anything. And lucky for us, as we've already mentioned, Trader Joe's has a ton of low carb keto friendly dips to dip these into. So the snacking possibilities with these are pretty much endless. Now, as far as the price goes on this bag of mini zucchini, Trader Joe's is charging $2.49 for this 12 ounce bag. The everything but the bagel smoked salmon at Trader Joe's, mm, it is one of my favorite snacks. I love snacking on smoked salmon. And if you pair this with some cream cheese, you are in just such delicious snack business. I mean, smoked salmon by itself, super good. But then when you add the everything but the bagel seasoning to it, it just takes it to a whole different level of Hastiness. Now, if you're wondering about the carb count on this because it is seasoned, there's no carbs because there's no sugar added to the salmon. Also, the price on the smoked salmon is really reasonable. It's $5.49 for this four ounce package here at Trader Joe's. In the cheese section of Trader Joe's, you're gonna find these Folios cheese wraps. And while these are not a snack in their own right, although I guess you could snack on these big circular pieces of Parmesan cheese, you can make a ton of different keto-friendly snacks with these cheese wraps. Now, the best thing about these cheese wraps is that each one has just one gram of naturally occurring carbs from the cheese itself. There's no sugar or anything else added 
to these wraps. It's literally just cheese and salt. That's it. Having said all that, the price on this four pack of cheese wraps is $4.49 at Trader Joe's. All right, so those are all the best low carb keto snacks at Trader Joe's right now in 2021. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I hope it gave you some ideas on snacks to pick up the next time you're at Trader Joe's. I'm sure I missed a snack here and there. So if I did and you always get something when you come to the store, let me know what I missed in the comments below. With that said, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in the next one.